Back in high school, I really liked chemistry. I thought that it was so cool that I could learn how to explain why things change colors when you mix them together, why things do what they do from a molecular level. I just thought that was so cool. I wanted to figure out how to make a career out of learning things like that. So the curiosity about science, the curiosity of how does this work, how do I fix this problem, is what drives me. It's what made all of the long nights of homework interesting because I got to a solution and went, I know how to do that, that's cool. One of the other great things about being in manufacturing is that just because you come in as an associate engineer doesn't mean that's how where you end up. Especially in manufacturing and with an engineering degree, you can do just about anything. Being innovative and creative is important to problem solving, especially when you have a 40-year-old or plus manufacturing plant because a lot of times the immediate answer has already been done and it's either not worked as long as you wanted it to or it hasn't worked at all. So you need to be creative about, okay, what can we do now? It's important to think of new solutions and that's how innovation is really involved in manufacturing, being creative about how to fix things and how to replace the old things. In the end, being able to say, I installed that and it works, is awesome.